Viral Menace was wondering, you know, he was asking, who was it, Dr. Drew? Yeah, I was asking Dr. Drew before, like, are some people just too far gone? Yeah, like, and I would say yes. I would, yeah, say yes. I would say yes. I mean, there's like a chemical imbalance in their brain. Right. right. I mean, is there any type of therapy that would bring them back to being normal? Well, uh, we were talking about that. Now, Jessica is calling in, and uh, she disagrees with the whole too far gone thing, and she's got some real life experience. Okay, sweet. Uh, good morning, Jessica. Good morning. Good morning. Hey. All right, so what do you got? So um, I was a heroin addict for 10 years straight. Didn't care about anything, couldn't hold a job down. I wound up being homeless in Atlantic City for a little while. It was really terrible. But once you get to the point where you break your soul, pretty much. um, Rock rock bottom? Like, not even rock bottom. I mean, like, I was throwing myself in front of vehicles in Atlantic City to get drunk. Yes. And um, I found out that I was pregnant, and I had tried for years to get pregnant. And it literally shattered me to the point where I woke up. I woke up and now I'm a single mom and I have a beautiful four year old and I've been clean for five years now. Wow. That's and awesome. honestly, thank you. And it's she is my miracle. She saved my life. She so really did. That was but it. So like once you, to- let me ask you a question. So once you found out that you were pregnant, like it wasn't like a like a detox kind of thing, did you just like stop just altogether? Cold turkey? After 10 no, years? I went, um, no, I went to um, an inpatient, I went to the hospital and then after that um, I was outpatient for a while, but I went to a three month rehab for a year and a half. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I kept going up. I kept showing up. Even when I had an infant, I kept showing up. Yeah. And the and baby like, was oh, born, it's... the baby was born healthy and everything. Yes. Wow. She was healthy. She has autism now, which is not, they said it has nothing to do with it. My brother has children with autism too, but you know what? It's, it is what it is, you know, things like that. But I, for a while, blamed myself that she had autism because of what I was into. But that's not the case. And I found that out. Like, wow. And so you're doing I good now. That. So you're clean. Five years, uh, you said. I'm clean. You got a job. I just got, I just got promoted to the manager of my job. Wow. Sweet. So awesome. really, um, but her father's another story. He's one yeah. of those people that nothing, nothing touched him. So he's not coming back. But yeah. when people have purpose, they come back. Yeah, they come back. Good. I just wanted to say there is people that make it. A lot of them don't, but there is people that make it. There is people that make it. All right, Jessica, thank Thanks, you so Jessica. much. Thanks, Jessica. Thank You're you welcome. for calling. Have Appreciate a nice day, guys. Thank you. All right, guys. Yeah, that's great. Wow. Yeah. I always like hearing hear when people are Definitely. able to, like, turn from that place, Oh my God. 10 years, yeah. turn it around. That's, that's awesome. That's great. Yeah.